And we're at a point today where we're just, we've knocked on a bunch of doors and come up empty. But someone's, someone's watching this kid, staying with this kid. A four-year-old from the west side is missing at this very hour. Police say Jaden McClure's family lied about where he is, and they are out of options other than to ask for someone to finally come forward. New tonight, we hear from that family. Nine on your side's Evan Millward spoke to the boy's great-grandmother. He joins us live in Delhi. Evan, had she seen the little boy at all? Craig, she says she hasn't seen him in weeks, but the family story doesn't exactly add up with what police have been telling us today. Officers say Jaden's dad told them he took the boy to South Carolina. Great grandma has actually heard the same thing, but when police couldn't track the four year old down there, they issued a critical missing alert this evening because they believe he could still be in the Cincinnati area. Delhi Township police say Misty McClure overdosed in this Pedretti Avenue home late on July 9th. They say four year old Jaden was inside that night, but not the next day when Job and Family Services arrived to take custody. It's been probably at least three weeks ago, maybe longer. It's been a while. It's been a great while. Police say he was here on the 9th. No, that's that's false advertising. That's Jaden's great grandma, Trula McClure. He's on a little scudder, but I still love him. She lives here too. Love to know where he's at. I mean, if if my life was set based on it, I could not say because I don't know. Misty McClure remained in jail Wednesday night. Police say she gave them the runaround when they asked where the four-year-old was on July 10th. It's known in their family now that JFS has custody of this kid, and someone is is harboring this kid and committing a crime within them themselves if they continue to. That goes for dad too. Jasper Pickett also arrested for interference of custody. Claimed that he had driven the kid down to South Carolina about a year ago, which we determined was certainly not true. Police say Pickett gave them phony addresses for where Jaden may be staying with family. It is a mess if ever in my life I was ever in a mess this is. Now, we tried to reach out and track down Pickett tonight. We know he is out of jail, but we didn't have any luck. Police here say, you just heard it, that they feel like they've knocked on doors and just come up short, so now they're turning to you for help. So if you know anything, you can call Del High Township Police or Crime Stoppers. That number, as always, is 513-352-3040. We're live in Del High Township tonight. I'm Evan Millward, 9 on your side. Evan